This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Let's get to uh, some news and notes as we head into the show. This is directly from the Observer. Triple H's role in the company was officially formalized in an executive position, and he's working in the office. His official title is senior advisor, which basically means he's working directly under Vince McMahon. He's been given a new office. One person noted it's really the role he's been doing as Vince's main advisor on the wrestling end of the business for nearly the past decade, but this formalizes it and also gives him a corporate title. So it kind of places him officially in one of their apparent roles. Uh, the uh, people largely figured he was getting, so he's positioned here as the heir apparent, if you will. He's going to be the uh, successor. Were you surprised when they formalized it? You know, a lot of times guys have, you know, sort of the nickname behind the scenes, right hand man. Lord knows Pat Patterson and once upon a time Bruce Pritchard did. But with them giving him the official title, it feels like uh, a bit of a shift. Now he's not just quote unquote one of the boys, even though nobody really considered him that at this point, I'm sure. What did this change anything as far as the way the locker room felt about him or not so much? Well, I think everybody, and I mean, fans and talent and different companies alike, that info made it through the grapevine long before it was announced. Right. Yeah. The, the only problem I would see having with it is when you have a guy that's still wrestling in a main event role Yeah. on your show, and now you tell him you know, and tell the audience that you've pretty much got the magic wand. You can wave it for yourself any way you want. I think you're immediately te- asking the audience to, to dislike that guy is having uh, more than an equal opportunity. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, uh, and I think, you know, once a guy has his own destiny in his hands, it kind of, it's kind of hard to put jeopardy on that guy. You know, you're not going to have a hunter, you know, if I lose, I'll retire. If I lose, I'll quit, you know, because everyone knows now he's firmly ingrained. He's not going anywhere, you know? So I think it takes away some of your options for him as a talent and the jeopardy you can put on him and, and the what ifs that may happen when you announce formally This guy's, he's the heir apparent. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at savewithconrad.com.